Yeah, man, what's really good? It's your boy, Give It Up. Y'all see the title. Y'all can read the title. Yes, all of these celebrities that you're looking at are all dead. Every last one of them. Now you saying, how we in here about the funeral? You wasn't supposed to. Simple as that. It was done in secrecy. In darkness. These are celebrities, after all, we're talking about. They do a lot of things in secrecy and darkness. And a lot of stuff that comes out about celebrities is simply smokescreen. It's not re reality. It's not what you're thinking it is. I made the video show you the DMX memorial was nothing but a sacrifice. Broke that down to molecules. You know what I'm saying? So... All of these celebrities that you're looking at have passed away. I promise you. And it's a lot more of them. And what we've been seeing of them is just a shell or the clone, the body double. You know what I'm saying? Remember the movie Invasion of the Body Snatchers where the actual real body gets replicated and the original body dies and the replica gets to live? This is exactly what's going on in real life. And to be ignorant, to click this video and be ignorant and tell yourself I'm talking bullshit. I mean, it's, it, it says a lot about you and, and your growing process. You know what I'm saying? Because I have no business to sit here and make up no bullshit like this when nothing like this exists. This is reality. This is what goes on in Hollywood. Hollywood that you love and you think is all on the surface of, of how they want you to see it. This is Hollywood. This is the truth of Hollywood. You know what I'm saying? Hollywood is ran by Satan himself. Seriously. That's the reason why it is so beautiful and addictive. Because it is ran by higher powers. It's not just ran by the actors and the actresses and the directors and shit like that. It's, it's, it's a way bigger picture than you're seeing, than you're choosing to believe. You know what I'm saying? So coming across these type of videos, don't be closed minded. It makes no sense. Shit is real. Remember that shit is real. So back to it. Um, All of them that you're seeing, Beyonce, Dave Chappelle, Gucci Mane, DMX, Jamie Foxx, the newest one to add to the list, Kanye West. You know what I'm saying? All of them, Eminem, they're all clones. They're not the real person walking around. Y'all remember the video I made showing you Jalen Rose, the ex-NBA player, right? At some NBA halftime show, getting ready for the halftime report. Some dude prepping him, giving him makeup and shit. And he's just standing there looking like a machine, looking like a robot. Facts. I show y'all the video. I wasn't just talking about it. I show it to y'all. He was standing there literally not even breathing. Same shit with Shaquille O'Neal on inside the NBA. He was sitting there stuck while everybody else was talking and the conversation was rolling. Shaq was just stuck, stuck in time. The shit didn't even go viral, right? But I made the videos and other people made videos. Anyways, those two dudes, for a fact, are robots. And I seen Draymond Green, I think his name is, he was in an interview where it seemed like somebody hit a button and just turn him off completely. And y'all gotta know that MK Ultra, which is what's behind you know a lot of this shit, is real. MK Ultra go back to I believe the 19th century, early 19th century. I, I did the homework, you know what I'm saying? I, I did the research. It go back a while. So this is not new technology. This is things that people of the world know about already. So all of them had their days already and passed on and we're just looking at their body double you know what i'm saying i show y'all even a video where they got wax figures that look exactly like the celebrity that's just an idea to show you that's just an idea to show you what the, is actually going on behind closed doors while you, you so close fucking minded thinking that you know everything on the surface is real everything they show you is real n none of this mind bending shit is going on they're getting away with everything because your ignorant ass is making them get away with everything because you're not even stopping to realize that 
just because it's unbelievable doesn't make it non-believable. It's still real. You know what I'm saying? I promise you. Eminem, if you look at Eminem, man, I'm telling you, that's not Eminem. And, you know, I'm not, I'm not going to be surfacey with it. I'm not going to be basic with it. I'm, I'm going to break it down a little bit. They all got this alter ego. The alter ego is simply the clone. It's the new person. It's Marshall Mathers, Eminem, the real Eminem. And then there's Slim Shady. The clone. At the end of the day, I know, you know, this is very subjective. You could come with your opinion and say, oh, that's bullshit, whatever, whatever, whatever. But you look at him. You feel him out. You, it's not the same person. You know what I'm saying? Beyonce. One of the main ones. I mean, Sasha Fierce is who you've seen walking around out here these days. Not Beyonce knows. Beyonce knows died a while back. It doesn't matter the year, the exact time and date. All that shit is irrelevant. She passed away a while ago. They got this demon named Sasha Fierce doing these performances and, and running around doing all this shit. Remember, even Beyonce's pregnancy was fake. You don't know what's real about none of them. They fake a lot of things for publicity stunt and shit like that. So you know they're into a lot of pretend shit. A lot of pretend shit. It's not what, it's not what we're thinking. It's not what you see on the surface. Don't just eat up the surface and run with it. Understand it's deeper than that. It's deeper than what they're showing you. You know what I'm saying? Um, Dave Chappelle, I just noticed how he just became very, like, very um compromised, very reserved now, very much non-opinionated. Like, you know what I'm saying? Very, very, very politically correct. This is not the real Dave Chappelle. This is not the original Dave Chappelle. It's a reason why, remember, this is the same dude that walked away from $50 million. Walked away from Hollywood. Because they wanted to compromise who he is. Now I'm telling you, he's absolutely compromised. He's on a lower level now because of the fact that they took his appeal away. Because that robot, that clone, is not appealing to anybody. You know what I'm saying? People are just fucking with him because of you know the the the, the remnants of of the real Dave Chappelle. They 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 under this spell, thinking that's really Dave Chappelle comedy show that they're attending these days but it's really not it's really not i'm telling y'all reality i'm telling y'all this is the realest shit you ever heard in your life this world is scary hollywood is hell hollywood belongs to satan it's a lot of manipulation it's a lot of trickery it's a lot of magic going on a lot of magic you know what i'm saying black magic things that we are not seeing for what it is we're under a spell in hollywood is the biggest world of spells. It's just all spells all day. Um, the, um, Jamie Fox. Jamie Fox. He goes under some some condition was going on with him. He's sick for a little while. All of a sudden, he comes out of sickness. His skin tone is is something different. His mannerism seems off. His just his whole delivery and his whole personality. And you can't deny that. People gonna deny that, but you can't deny it. The truth is, it's solid, bro. You can't go around what's real. Check out Jamie Foxx, man. That's not Jamie Foxx. That's not him. And you're gonna see more proof. And people gonna keep trying to disprove it. Because it's uncomfortable truth. This isn't some uncomfortable truth right here. This is not what you wanna hear about. You don't wanna hear your favorite celebrity died a while ago and you've only been fucking with a clone for 10 years, five years, whatever. You don't want to know that, but it's real. It's very real. Gucci, man. They said the real Gucci died in jail, bro. They said they killed that nigga in jail, straight up. The story came out, I read the whole shit. It's like years ago, this is like, it's like mad years ago. They said he died in jail. All of a sudden, he comes out, so-called comes out, because it's only a clone that's entering in society, perpetrating a fraud, perpetrating like it is the real Gucci man. But you know, he, Gucci's coming out of jail. He comes out. Nothing about him seems like the original Gucci man, right? He's in super fit, fit shape. You know, he got a thirty pack. You know, he's married. He's 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 
all this fake shit. I mean, everything is fake. Everything, a lot of things is so fake. You don't know what's real. You do not know what's real. You just got to pay attention. You just got to pay attention. Y'all can't tell me Kanye West is the original Kanye West that came out and, and said the government don't care about black people. And if he was to die right now, he would be, he would make the Bible. If they write a new Bible, he would make it. And he would be one of the main characters in the Bible and shit like that. That was when actually he was he was his real self. He was in his right mind. Not anymore. Ever since he came from that facility with Donald Trump, he hasn't been the same Kanye West in any type of way. A lot of people think, oh, since they killed his mother, that's when he changed. But not really, because let's keep it real. He was behind that. He did that. That didn't change him. That propelled him. That was a sacrifice he made straight like that. You know what I'm saying? So he hasn't, you know, he hasn't been nowhere near the type of personality he had when he first came out. Back to what I said in the beginning, the personality, the spirit be on some other shit. You know, it's not the same person because the spirit be different. It's not that same spirit that you're familiar with. That's how you know. I don't care which one of them we want, we want to talk about. You know what I'm saying? DMX, a little bit before he so-called passed away because he been died. You know what I'm saying? He been died on the low in darkness, in secrecy. But when they said he passed away or whatever like that, you know what I'm saying? I notice everybody can notice the physical alteration of DMX, the personality alteration. X wasn't talking like X no more. You know what I'm saying? The, you know, that, 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 that gritty dog shit that he liked to do, whatever, was there. But that's just, that's just replicating the old DMX. You know what I'm saying? DMX had no business, but it's really the clone, had no business doing that song with that girl, Catch Me Outside. The real DMX would have never did that. That's not X. That's the clone did that. A complete controlled clone. They control these machines. These are not the humans. These are machines, y'all. That's it. This video going to definitely need a part two, man. But I appreciate y'all for tuning in to part one. So, boy, give it up 100, man. I'm going to y'all.